Hey everyone, Jason here from Lightmare, and welcome to the community update number 4. This video and Infinity Wars Classic are made possible by our amazing Patreon supporters. More about them at the end of the video. It's been a while since we've had a community update, so there's a bunch to update you on. Firstly, the card counter for Infinity Wars Classic of old IW1 cards is now over 540, meaning we're about three quarters of the way through implementing all of the old IW1 cards into IW Classic. We also have some brand new cards being released. We have slowed down on the newer cards to focus on IW1 cards for now, but you'll hear us getting very loud about our newest set, Intrigue, in the coming months. Next up, there's been a change to resolution phases, meaning that not only has the turn order returned to its original implementation in IW1, but we also have click to continue resolution, meaning you won't have effects showing up and moving on before you have time to fully react and take them in. Your game will now proceed more in line with your selected most comfortable speed of playing. Battlefields are back, and while you generally get these by playing location cards in the game, we're also giving some patrons the ability to set their battlefield default before the game starts. You won't get the card's effects, obviously, but for a cosmetic benefit, it's pretty cool. Due to our focus on getting as many IW1 cards in as possible, our monthly competitive tournaments are being placed on hold for now, and we're accumulating the prize pool for a larger one down the line. We're fully committed to growing the competitive scene of the game, we'll just be focusing a lot more on that when the game is further developed. And here's a pretty big one, we've finally updated the main branch of Infinity Wars 1 to the demo of Infinity Wars Classic. When we are more confident in the game and its current standing, we can release as a free-to-play title. However, while we're still actively working on the core game itself, we want to be very careful with what we put out to people who aren't up to date with the context on how we got here and why we're doing what we're doing. But at the same time, it felt like it was important to give players a chance to see exactly what we've built up over the last year without having to support us through Patreon. It only contains a set number of decks and the deck builder is disabled for this game mode, but if you're looking for a hit of nostalgia for your old favourite TCG, or maybe want a sample before you'd be confident enough signing up to become an actual Patreon supporter, either way, this is exactly what you need. We do have another video talking about the demo and our history of how we got here, but for now, this is something to be excited about. Speaking of, this video was brought to you by all of our Patreon supporters, which you can see on screen now. If you want to become a Patreon supporter and get full access to the game and a ton of other bonuses, check out InfinityWarsClassic.com for more information. You can also join the Discord server linked in the description of this video if there's any other questions you have about IW Classic, the dev team, our favourite sandwiches, whatever, we'd love to hear them. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video, Rift Runner.